businesses are calling for the streamlining of regulatory authorities to avoid overlapping of mandates that make it harder to do business in the country. Now, private sector stakeholders in a meeting with the Cabinet Secretary of East African Community and Regional Development, uh, Aidan Mohammed, also urged the government to fast-track issuance of licenses which would enable faster business registration. On its part, the government stated it has continually reevaluated the ease of doing business matrix, pushing Kenya to the top 50 mark. Let's get more from our very own Faisal Ahmed. Everybody has done a fantastic job, and that is reflected in the journey that we have traveled so far, where we moved, as earlier told, from position 136 in 2014 out of 190 countries, meaning that we are the bottom quartile globally to two years ago to position 56. And, and that is a remarkable growth, a remarkable business I mean, uh, activity in terms of reforms that we have done. Complexity around these things. So although we are partly impatient about the changes, it's also good to recognize that these things are complex. Just as we were talking about NCA, that's another area we had an interest in. An interest in. You have, when you talk about construction, you have the contractors, you have NEMA, you have the county, you have the Ministry of Lands, uh, you have all these entities that must be involved. The same thing with the Companies Act. I think Carol talked a lot about the Companies Act and how long it took. You can imagine BRS is the same. There are banks. There, there are so many people you need to bring together. But that is the work. And we need to continue doing that to bring all those people together 